All right, we're phone jamming here on the Stephen D.C. Show. Home of the morning phone sham call. And I believe we got a ballistic O'Rear sister this time. Is that right, Jimmy? That's right. All right. Hello. Hello, good morning. Good morning. Is this the chief? Yes, ma'am, it is. This is the number they gave me then. I'm calling about... Saturday, I understand you need some extra officers on Saturday. Is that right? Extra officers for what, ma'am? I, I got a message. I got a message from Mayor Hill from Sandersville. Yes, ma'am. That, that some extra officers were needed on Saturday. I'm fr friends with Mayor Hill's family. I have been for several years. And I was told that, that some extra officers were needed on Saturday. Not, not that I'm aware of, ma'am. Well, Mayor Hill said that on Saturday, with all the big going down, that uh, they were going to uh, need some extra officers. And I'm calling because I need to uh, let you know that my grandson is perfect for this job. He is trustworthy and honest and, and needs it, quite frankly. Uh, of a little discipline. He really needs that on Saturday. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> well, I don't need any extra officers right now, ma'am. I've got all I can all I can stand right now. Well, Mayor Hill, and I would presume that Mayor Hill is who you answer to. Is that right? Yes, ma'am. Well, Mayor Hill said that without a doubt, uh, I could call you and tell you about my grandson. Okay, to who, uh, can I ask who I'm speaking to, please, ma'am? My name's Velma, and I'm calling about my uh, my son. His name's Cooter. That's his that's his nickname. My grandson. That we everybody calls him Cooter. Mm -hmm. And let me just tell you a little bit about him. Can I do that? Mm-hmm. He's first of all, he's got the build uh, for an officer. He's tall and skinny. Uh, he can run uh, very fast. He's very fast. Uh, he's about 48. I think he turned 48 in January, 48 or 49, and so he's perfect for the job. Yeah, I got a beep. Can you hang on just a minute, please? Man? No, I can't hang on. He watches all the cop shows. His favorite's Car 54, Where Are You? He loves that show. He watches uh, uh, NYPD Blue. He likes that a lot. He also, he loves Clint Eastwood. He walks around saying that phrase, Go ahead, make my day. I mean, he says that all the time. He'll say it to me sometimes. He'll say, he'll say, Grandmama, he'll say, Go ahead. Make my day. He's for good. He knows all the lines from all the cop shows. Well, I got a beat. Can you hang on just a minute? So I went out and I bought uh, Cuda a gun. Uh, on, I bought Cuda a gun on Friday. And I, I'm not going to give him any bullets yet until he gets comfortable with it. Mm -hmm. good, good for you. But I told him I'd give him bullets maybe on Thursday or Friday. Well, I, I got a beat. Can you hang on just a minute, please? He sleeps with his super soaker. Uh, right by his side. Got to have his soaker right there. Mm -hmm. He's perfect for this job. Yeah. Perfect for him. And it'll be good for him. Yeah. I'm asking you to help me out because it'll be good for him to get there. Just tell him fill out an application is all I can tell him. He'll, he'll look you right in the eye like mm -hmm. if, let's say he's pursuing a bandit. Mm -hmm. Let's say there's a bandit out there and he's going after him. He'll look the bandit right in the eye like he does me sometimes, and he'll say, go ahead, make my day. Oh, it just scares him to death. Nip it in the bus. It scares me sometimes when he, because he gets so serious, and he's got these beady little eyes. Nip it in the bus. And he'll look right at you, he'll cut right through you, and he'll say, go ahead. Well, I, look, I, I'm having you ready to come to work, so if he can excuse me, tell him to come put an application in. Uh -huh. And we'll talk to him. Well, Chief, listen, if you don't, uh, by the way, if he, oh, this would make you think, if he, I guess down to something else, if he were, I've got a beep, hang on just a minute, no, okay? No, no, this is official police business, Chief. Uh, Chief? Nip it in the bus. Hello? Hello? Okay. Police business, Chief.
The bus. If he gets the job on Saturday, can you give him the number car 54? Can you give no, him the bus? Then everybody can get on the speaker and say, car 54, where are you? No, ma'am. Where are you? Uh, you know who else told me that uh, you needed help on Saturday? Mm-hmm. Davy, Davy called me and said on yeah. Saturday, you Davy <clears throat> Keith. You well, see, well, see, Davy, right. see, Davy's fired. He don't know it yet. <laughs> <laughs> Hello, Davy. Hey, Officer Keith. Yeah. Say hi to uh, Chief Galabi. Good yeah. morning, Chief. Good morning, Davy. You're fired. Turn your stuff in, son. <laughs> Just put it in the bag. Don't even come by the police department. Hey, Chief. Yeah. I just go ahead and shoot him. I am. <laughs> a gut shot. I guess I need to come in this morning then, huh? I told him he was brave, and we can never drive through your city now. That's right. That's oh, it. Oh, man. <laughs> I drive a pink Studebaker, just so you know. <laughs> yeah, I've easy. seen that car before. I, mean, <laughs> <laughs> I think, uh, Chief Dusty, what really got you was the fact that he says, go ahead and make my day. I yeah. Think, yeah, that's what <clears throat> Yeah, that sounds like Davey, except there's one, there's one problem. What? He's not going to have a day to make it. <laughs> <laughs> Officer Cooter O'Rear just kind of got a ring to it. That's, yeah. that's it, buddy. All right. Well, Chief, I hope we didn't wait. Yeah. No, I'm, I'm getting ready to come up there and go to the salt mine. All righty. Now, uh, Keith, Davy Keith, are you working today? I don't know. Uh, <laughs> probably not. Probably never. All right. <laughs> well, y'all keep doing that good work, and we appreciate you in Sandersville, Mississippi. All right. Hey, thank you, fellas. Okay. Thanks, yeah. Davy. Thank you, guys. <laughs> Right uh, nice guys. Uh, by the way, now you can see them on CBS every Friday night on Sandersville CSI. <laughs> hey, listen, we want CSI Sanders.